<laughs> he can't hear with that thing. <laughs> All right, we're out. My buddy's busy cleaning the yard over there. So I guess if there's a center divider, we don't have to stop. It's only for the people that are on the other side. Because I just see this fire uh, truck in front of us. It. Not like an actual fire truck, but just a regular like fire department like utilization truck, I guess you could say. They went through it, everyone else did. So I'm going through too. But yeah, if there was no divider, I think I'd have to stop. But thank God I don't because man, I am running late. Definitely running late. Uh, this time is not right on this display. I mean, it's close, but not 100% right. I uh, stayed at my house as long as possible because uh, my steam deck was coming in. I Yeah, I, so there's a long story about that. Um, <laughs> but I, I have two now. I'm going to be selling one. It's probably either going to be sold, and if I haven't sold it by the time this video goes out, then uh yeah i'm just gonna probably maybe give it as a like a gift for uh christmas or something i don't know maybe to my girl or something if she might use it if she doesn't think she's gonna use it then forget it but anyways but i was staying at home because uh i needed to get my stuff but my 7950x ryzen cpu did not show up so i'm hoping that doesn't show up while i'm at work um, someone will be at my house in about an hour so let's just hope it doesn't come in the next hour because if it does i have to sign for it and if they just leave it at my house i'm gonna be pissed there's a lot of stuff that i'm supposed to sign for that says signature from ups or fedex and they still just drop it off at my door it's crazy like so far so good i haven't had anything stolen and i do have a uh, camera at the front of my house too and you know i got cameras at the driveway but still that doesn't mean anything people are still going to like take your stuff cameras really don't do much it's just you know you can kind of see who did it all right I'm going this way. don't be merging over i want a bike Alright, we're gonna bicycle this this way. See look at that, easily fit in traffic. There you go. Bicycle hacks. I am like so pumped up to show you guys this uh, new PC build once it's done. It's gonna take a little bit of time but it's gonna be sick. I'm excited. It's gonna pretty much be my new PC for the next two years or so, maybe three. And that's what I'm gonna be editing all this footage on. Probably, I wanna say give it a, I don't know, I work pretty fast. Uh, I'm gonna say give it a month and that PC should be completely done. But we'll see, we'll see how what time tells. I already know the case I'm gonna get, the 700D. It's not as nice as the 700X from Corsair, and it doesn't come with the fan controller like the uh, Commander Pro or whatever, but I want more airflow. Um, I want it to look nice with a bunch of RGB and everything, but I mean, I use my computer a lot, and it's always getting super, super hot, and I wanna have the best, uh, you know, cooling because, you know, I actually need to rent. Ah, shit! Ah, damn. Something just ran right into my eye. Oh, my God, that hurt. Oh, my God. Hold on, hold on. Oh, my God. No, that's that wasn't funny. Oh, shit. I'm glad I can open my eye and see. Oh, my God. That's the first time that's ever happened to me. Oh, man, my eyes are going to be so red, like I smoked weed or something. Holy hell. I've never, ever had anything hit me in the eye like that. Oh, my eyes just watering like crazy now. Oh, man. I'm so glad I can open my eye right now. That was terrible. Oh, wow. Let me know in the comments if you ever had that happen. Holy crap, I can't wait to get to work to see how my eye looks because, damn. I'm glad my contacts didn't even get messed up either. I can still see, so we're good. 
Uh, oh my god, what, what was I talking about? So I know uh, my, my computer gets really hot, so I want something that's really, really going to work. You know what, I'm going to put my visor down because uh, it feels like there's just, my eyes are getting messed up now. And since I use my computer a lot for editing, that thing is maxed out. I mean, I'm using 90% of my RAM and it's a 32 gig. And then uh, my CPU, it's a, uh, what am I running right now? It's a 5900X from Ryzen. And that thing gets hot also. Oh God, here comes the bump. Um, but uh, I don't know, I just want something that's going to keep everything cool. And I know the new process is a 7950X they will instantly hit about 90 to 95 but uh, if you still don't have a good cooler it can still throttle it's it's made to sit at 90 or 95 temperature wise and then as soon as you're done with the process it actually just drops dramatically you guys checking out the bike it's like everyone around this area checks out the bike but anyway so uh 7000 d case i think we're gonna go with the airflow function over form and uh, I think I might get the Corsair, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's the 170i or the H170i, um, the LCD display. So it actually has like a little LCD display on your uh, CPU cooler so you can see like your CPU temp like right in there. It's kind of cool even though I have programs that tell me all that kind of stuff. I'm excited for that, it's gonna be so cool. And then the RAM is the hardest thing. So get this, before the processors came out, obviously DDR5 has been out for a while. But what sucks ass is that, you know what, we're gonna take that street. I've never taken that street. We're gonna take that street today. Um, is that all the DDR5 memory that I was looking at before the processor went out, they were in stock and now they're not. So I'm like, oh my God. And I don't know what I wanna go with yet. I'm pretty sure I might have it ordered in the next, like I might even have it ordered tomorrow, I don't know. But I don't know if I want to go with 6,000 because they're saying 6,000 is like the best to go with for um, the rise, the new Ryzen series. Or if I go with 5,600 and then it won't be overclocked, that's like native, uh, 6,000 would be overclocked. I don't know. I just don't know what I want to do yet. I got to figure it out. Um, but everything's pretty much sold out. So I don't know what to do yet. So I guess this road's closed, but everyone's been going through it. Never taken this way, but I think it's pretty much a straight up shortcut to where I need to go. And why is it closed? If it's already done, why is it closed? Someone tell me that. Oh, okay. Wow, I should have been taking this way a while back. Holy crap, are you turning? Thanks for the signal. Dude, this is like a complete shortcut from where I would have had it gone right now. Wow, now I'm glad I know where this takes me. So that's crazy. That used to be a dead end back there. And I remember mentioning that a couple of times, but now it's not a dead end. Now it's a, a street that goes all the way through. But here we go. So that means I could take that way going back also to get to the bridge. So I have to deal with it. I just saved myself probably uh, two, oh God, ah, <laughs> two minutes. Yeah. And then uh, I think I'm gonna fill up the case with uh, the, Cor uh, the Corsair, the ML140 Pro fans. They're gonna all be RGB. I think I'm gonna order a pack of two or maybe a pack of three, I'm not sure. Uh, I think I only need two though because the cooler will come with three and I wanna do a push pull configuration. So then I'll order two more packs which come with two each, so that's four more. So then I can put three on the other side of the radiator for push pull on the CPU. And then the extra 140 can go on the back of the case. And then I'll figure out maybe some different fans to put in the front. I don't know yet. But I'm excited to build this thing. I'm literally going to be selling my old PC complete. All I'm going to do is pull out my hard drives. I'll leave one of the NVMe drives in there just so it can boot up and you guys can see it working and all that kind of stuff or the people I'm going to sell it to and, you know, on Craigslist. But I don't know how much I'm going to ask for it. I mean, it has a 3080 RTX card in there. Um, it's water cooled. It's from EVGA. It's a uh, For the Wind 3 and it's hydro cooled. And then I have a 5900X in there too. And then the NVMe drive, I'm, I'm not sure what it is. It might be a one terabyte or a 512, not 100% sure. 
and then all the other specs you know they're really good nice case be quiet case love the case actually i wish i could use it for my new build but it was just ever so slightly smaller than what i wanted the case to be so i don't know who's revving someone's revving over there by willis fargo interesting all right well i'll see you guys later at night time third video in a row going to work I promise this will probably hopefully be the last one unless something major happens when I go to work next couple days. Um, no, I take that back. There's probably going to be another <laughs> another few videos now that I think about it. Huh? What's up? Oh, uh, just give me shit. I got 30 minutes still. Oh, you're 3.30, not 3? Yeah, 3.30. Oh. Yeah. I wouldn't have got here this late. <laughs> I know. I was like, isn't John 3 o'clock? Where the fuck is he? Yeah. I don't think I'm going to make it. Oh, shit. Onyx is not good for turning. But I, I did make it, though. I'll give it that. Definitely made it. Yeah, buddy, let's go! Oh, yeah, we'll take that one street I was, I was talking about. Bye. Bye, car. I forgot all about it. That's our little shortcut now. So uh, work was, it was pretty chill for the most part, uh, not too bad. I was the manager today, so uh, that was great. I get paid extra to be the manager, so I mean, it's extra money in my pocket. The only bad thing about being the manager is uh, obviously everything falls on me. And the other bad thing about being a manager is I don't do it very often. Um, it looks like they're gonna start having me in charge a lot more, so that's gonna be cool but I just gotta get used to it. I haven't done it like, I did it a month right before I went to Vegas. That was a while back. And then the time before that was like in January of 2022. So I've only done closing like three times this year. Let's see if this car is gonna go straight or if they're going to turn. Cause I'm gonna go through. Bye car. Dude, look how small this street is. Do they not seem to think of like how big cars are? A big old truck coming through here, it's it's too small. Now I gotta give them credit that they made the bike lane half the size of the regular lane for a car, but no, that's that's not right. <laughs> oh crap. This is all messed up. That's a sharp turn right there. I bet you that car is all like, oh man, he went straight. And they were making a U-turn. Like, suck it. It was straight up open, though. Someone moved all the signs, so it is what it is. All right, so come on now. Yeah! Pick me up. Uh, I have my helmet tilted a little bit more down, so hopefully it looks a little bit better. Uh, my face is almost hitting the front of the helmet just because of it but i think what i'm gonna do is i think i'm gonna dribble out a little tiny bit of my bracket so my camera goes down a little bit farther so i don't have to wear my helmet like this because i've noticed that especially on the super 73 with the small ass bars you barely see the bars and you see more of the road in the sky because it's such a wide angle so we gotta get more of the bike in frame so i think we gotta work on that one of these days i'll do it when i got time but as of right now it's not gonna be happening It sucks, as I was at work, I missed my FedEx package by, man, was it like 15 minutes? If they would have came 15 minutes later, someone would have been at my house to sign for it, but instead, no, I didn't get my package for my CPU for my 7950X so I can start doing stuff with it. I would have took a nice picture, I would have posted, oh God, <laughs> I would have posted it on Instagram on my story facebook whatever and then i would have put the cpu in the motherboard and then what i really need to do is uh i need to order the case right away once we get the case we can just start throwing everything in there because what's going to happen is i'm going to have boxes after boxes of like pc parts but i have nowhere to put them in so as i start getting the parts i can start throwing them in the pc case and build it as i go and then like i said we'll do like uh 
a final video after it. It's probably gonna be a month or so. I'm excited as hell though. I am so excited. I could talk about my PC like all day. It's kind of like, you know, like I'm really into it right now. It's kind of like when I first got into electric bikes, I was like, I'm all into it. That's all I want to talk about. And I probably bored the hell out of people. Like people don't want to hear your stories about what you're into, your hobbies, if they're not into it every single day. They might act like they're like, oh, that's cool. That's cool. But they're probably just kind of like dismissing you and just kind of like whatever. But yeah, buddy, though, I am excited to go home. It's very late. I'm going to edit a video tonight and then we're probably going to call it a day. And yeah, we got a lot more working videos. I mean, I don't know how many I'm going to post, but I got a lot of reviews to do. I'm thinking about um, buying uh, the smart lights or the smart LED pedal lights for all my electric bikes. Like all the ones I ride anyway, like on the daily, the Onyx, Super 73 already has them, and then the Suron. The only thing I'm worried about with doing them on the Suron is, am I gonna get like pulled over when a cop sees that there's pedals on it? Because my Super 73, is just straight up like it looks like an electric bike like you can't say it's not this looks like all like you know custom custom built and stuff like they don't know it has a bigger motor or battery on it, it just looks like it has like custom parts on it to make it look cool but um what was i gonna say about that yeah i forgot what i was gonna say oh um but the other day when we were actually right here next to the cops we had the pedals on the super 73 and they didn't say shit so i mean i don't know i don't know if we can get away with it or not hey, this guy's inching forward you jump sir you hella jump dang they really didn't want to sit behind that uh semi they're just gonna get on the freeway right there <laughs> well why is it so dusty what the heck? See, this is why I'm getting sick around here. Oh, I hear someone like using a blower. What the heck? I definitely hear someone using a blower. You guys hear that? Using a blower, it's 12.30 at night. This time's a little off. 12.30, you guys probably can't even see the display anyway, honestly. You guys probably don't even know how fast I'm going. I'm still debating what I want to do with this Onyx next. Like, I really have no idea. I really don't know what to do. I, I love the way the bike is now. I mean, I get my range. It's pretty comfortable for the most part. I mean, the suspension still sucks ass, but I mean, what am I going to do? Um, I did want to change out these brake levers and stuff and maybe some brake pads. Um, but other than that, like, I mean, the bike's completely fine. There's nothing I can really do to it. That's gonna change anything on this bike to make it look cooler. I don't have the rear rack on here because I do not care for the rear rack. I never use it, I use my backpack. And I just feel like there's no point. Um, it just adds extra weight onto it and extra length and it's hard to like store it places. Like at my work when I gotta put it in a little tight area and then lock it up. So I just don't really care. Ow. It would be nice to have a little Bluetooth speaker on here though, but I'm, I would never use it also because I vlog on the bike. So there goes that. Ooh, it's cold now. Oh my God. This is the first time ever I have felt it be cold after work. Like legit, what the? This thing's still here. Remember we ran that over earlier uh, on the last video? Anyways, um, wow. This is the first time I actually, I'm freezing now. Like that's actually like super, super cold. Man, man alive. But other than that, guys, you already know what time it is. If you watch all the videos every day, each day, whatever, uh, <laughs> you already know it's over because we're already home. So I will see you guys in the next time. Love you guys. Peace out. True MVPs. And remember, I don't know how close we're going to be to 15,000 subscribers by the time this video goes out. We'll probably still have another five or 600 to go. But um, yeah. Pay attention because when we hit uh, 15,000 subscribers, give me like a week after that and I'll probably post a video talking about the giveaway we're going to do and how to enter and all that kind of fun stuff. So see you guys in the next one. Peace.